Welcome to my channel, the Ilocanos and Cuyunon. For today's video, I'm going to share about animal production, lesson 4, breeds of farm animals. Farm animals is a type of animal that is raised or breed on the farm. Just like the humans, every animal inherits two genes of each trait from their parents. Some genes are more dominant than others. So what is farm animals? Farm animals are animals that are bred for either meat, dairy products, or to assist farmers. There are a wide variety of breeds of farm animals and it's impossible to list all the animals that can live on the farm. But here are some of the most prevalent along with some information on how they benefit human and they're used for. First, we have the breeds of poultry. The different breeds of poultry may be classified according to the purpose of their production. Number one is cornish. It is excellent in meat but poor in egg layers. Number two is the Rhode Island Red. One of the most popular among heavy breeds, fairly good in egg layers and excellent in meat quality. Number three, leghorn. High egg producers with white shelled egg. Number four is Cantonese or Cobb. Medium in size, good layer of medium sized eggs, and well suited in Philippine condition. Number five is the New Hampshire. Good egg laying average and good meat qualities. Next breeding is the breed of swine. Number one is Landrace. Color white. Ears Hanging. Country of origin is from Denmark. Characteristics. Long face. Good and prolific mothers. Weak legs. Next for the breed of swine, we have the large swine. Color. White. Ears. Standing. Meat. Type. Country of origin. England. Characteristics. Fertile. High quality meat. Fast grower. Number 3, Berkshire. Color, black with 6 white points. Ears, standing. Type, large. Country of origin, England. Characteristics, short, black skin, more resistant to diseases compared to white breed. Number 4, Hampshire. Color, Black with white band. Ears standing. Type meat. Country of origin USA. Characteristics short, good quality meat, strong legs. Number five, the rock jersey. Color red or golden. Ears two third erect, one third hanging. Type meat. Country of origin, USA. Characteristics, good constitution, strong legs, fast grower, resistant to stress. Number six, pie train. Color, black and white. Ears, standing. Meat, very meaty. Country of origin, Belgium. Characteristics, very meaty ham and loin, very susceptible to stress. Next animal is the breed of goat. Number one, alpine. Characteristics, at mature age, it weighs 70 kilos and could produce 1.5 liters of milk every day. It is from European breed that has upright ears and straight face and colors that very uh, vary from black, red, and off white. Number two, Anglo Nobian. Characteristics: a tropical breed known for its fluffy, pendicious pair of ears and a mix of brown and black, or sometimes just brown or brown hair. It weighs 70 to 90 kilos at mature age and can produce 1.2 liters of milk daily. Number 3, boar. Characteristics, they are known for their 
high quality meat and excellent producive or productive qualities. Compared to other local goats, they are fairly larger in size and are double muscled. They are easy to raise and have mild temperament, are affectionate, required no milking, no special care, sharing, or fancy fences. Not only that, they can also glaze in the coldest of weather. Number 4. Native Characteristics This breed color ranges from red, white, black, or the combination of the three. At mature age, it can weigh up to 30 kilos. Its milk production, however, can just be enough for its young. Number 5. Saanin Characteristics Its weight can go up to an average of 70 kilos, which help in its being a highest milk producer among other breeds. It can tote up to 1.8 liters daily. This breed originated from Switzerland and boasts its pure white to off-white color. Number 6. Togenberg Characteristics Also from Switzerland, Togenberg are easy to spot. They have white marking in their face and erect ears like cyanin. At mature age, their milk produ production can around or can amount up to 1.5 liters every day. Next is the breed of sheep. Number 1, Portland. Number 2, Merino. Number 3, Shiviot. Next is the breed of cattle. Number 1, Philippine cattle. Characteristics, they are very hardy, prolific, and resistant to diseases. They belong to the dual purpose type because local farmers usually use them as work animals and later on sell them for beef. The most popular of this type is the Batangas strain. Number 2, Nilor. Characteristics, the animals under this breed are active and strong so they make good work animals. The animal has hump but they are not as prominent as those of the Brahman. They also have the Pendusius Julap. Number 3. Santa Gertrudes Characteristics The cattle under this breed have almost non-recognizable hum. Their colors range in shade of red. Like Brahman, they have the ability to adapt to the hot climate of the Philippines and they can also equal the calving efficiency of the Philippine cattle. This breed is a good source of beef. Number 4, American Brahman. Characteristics. This breed is considered the best among the imported breed of commercial beef cattle in the country. It is recognized through the hump over the shoulder. It is grayish white in color with very loose, pendulous skin along the dewlop and under the throat, extending between the forelegs. It has large, dropping ears and horn that curve upward and backward. Number 5. Tar Parkar Characteristics The animals under this breed are considered dairy cattle. However, they can also be used as work animals. They are grayish and white in color with horn that are rather small. They have long number 6 red shindy. Characteristics. This breed originated from Pakistan and is known for its hump. It is docile and considered to be a dual purpose. Breed aside from being a good source of milk and beef, the Steer may be used as work animals. Next is the breed of Carabao. Number one, native Carabao. Number two, Tamarau. Number three, Mura Buffalo. For your activities, 
Identify the breed based on the characteristics described. Number one, a breed of poultry that is excellent in meat but poor in egg layer. Number two, pig breed that possesses a white color and hanging ears. Number three, this breed is known for being a good layer and has a good quality meat. Number four, the breed of goat known for its high quality meat and excellent productive qualities. Number five, this breed of cattle is also known as Batangas strain. Submit your activities to your subject teachers. That's all for today. It's shoutout time! Hello, hello sa lahat ng ating mga viewers at sa ating mga subscriber. Especially sa ating mga new subscriber in the house. Hello, hello at magandang buhay po sa lahat. Sunod natin babatiin si Mark Jason Valdez na nagpapashoutout. At uh, maraming salamat sa patunood at palaging pagsubaybay pa lang ka. Kinabati din natin ng mega love shoutout si Kian Gabriel Tolentino. Maraming salamat sa panunood pa lang ka. At para naman po sa iba na gusto rin magpa-shoutout, uh, isulat nyo lang po or i-text ang inyong mga pa-shoutout dyan po sa ating uh, comment section or sa ating chat box. At ito po ay aking pupusuan. At kung nagustuhan nyo naman po itong ating videos, uh, pakilike na rin po at uh, pakishare din po itong ating videos para mas marami pa po ang makapanood. At para naman po sa iba na hindi pa nakasubscribe sa ating channel, umari lang naman po, subscribe din po itong ating munting channel. At pakihit na rin po ang notification bell para lagi po kayong updated sa mga videos na ating inilalabas. Kaya nga dito lang po muna. Bye! Ito po ang inyong lingkod. Iloka na po ang aking nanay. At kuyunin po ang aking tatay. Ako po ay Pure Pinay!